Hi crafters, this is Jerry with Crafty Stash and uh, I was doing some cards and I came up with this idea. I'm sure it's not new, but it's new to me. I thought I'd share a little tip when you're uh, doing your stamps. Now I'm using my We Are Memory Keepers Precision Press and I love it. It's much less expensive than the other uh, by far, but as I was doing this video, I was going to look up the price just to give that information to you and I come to find they're discontinued. I don't know why, but I uh, went to We Are Memory Keepers uh, Facebook site and I saw that there was a comment uh, asking about it. And every place that I've looked, HSN where I purchased mine and scrap booking.com, Michaels, none of them have them available. They are discontinued, even on Amazon. So you might be able to pick up one, say, on um, eBay or something like that. But nonetheless, it's the same idea. Uh, it is a stamp press. And so I was making cards, and I wanted to put some sayings on them, like, with sympathy, get well soon, bish wishes and such but I like to use different stamps I have tons of stamps this particular one is uh, close to my heart and then I had some from uh, crafters companion uh, that came with my came with my um, uh, diamond press die cutter which I love it's so small and convenient I have it on my desk all the time I'm using it anyway these are the stamps that came with uh, some of the die sets uh, that I purchased quite a while back on HSN but they're still available anyway the idea is that when you're using and I only use the clear stamps I don't use rubber stamps so I don't know about that but uh, Different brands have different thicknesses. So these are the close to my heart. These are the uh, Crafter's Companion. And the Crafter's Companion are thinner. And these are thicker. So what I did to work that out was uh, I, I have a piece of dark paper here because my camera won't focus if it's all white. But I put a, a piece of foam. This particular foam comes with every stamp set from close to my heart be for this purpose. We use them strictly for the stamping because you want a little give when you have the stamps. And especially if you're using different stamps from different stamp companies, you want to have that give as well if you're doing it all at once because of the thickness. So I put that down and then I put my paper on top of that. Any type of scrap paper is what I used. And then I inked up my uh, inked up my um, my stamps and pressed it down. Now you want to make sure that you have contact and you want to hold it for a moment because it's not always necessarily the pressure that you're putting down uh, but it's the length of time that it takes just a moment for that ink to absorb into your paper and again every paper is different every stamp is different every ink is different so you have to kind of uh, just figure that out for yourself but simply said uh, it came out perfect and uh, and I owe it all to the to the bit of um, foam that I used on there as well. So that's the idea that I came up with and I'm um, so sorry that the uh, We Are Memory Makers do not have the press anymore but I'm sure they'll come out with something else if you can find one on sale uh, that somebody else is giving away. I would pick one up. I probably paid maybe $15 for this. So it's a great item and I love We Are Memory Keepers all of their products anyway. So that's my tip for today and I hope you have a wonderful day crafting and I will see you again real soon.